abs are still abbing, so I love that for us. <laughs> Good morning, beautiful people. <laughs> um, it is Saturday, November 5th or 6th. 6th. It's Saturday, November 6th, yes. Um, so, Ryan and I are about to go on a walk at the Katy Trail in Dallas. So, I'm going to leave the camera here because I want to let it charge for a little while. And then when I come back, we're going to... Um, reconvene and i'll let y'all know what i'm doing so i'm gonna do a little bit of maintenance today i'm gonna be going to get a wax today and then um after that i'm gonna go and do some shopping because i want to get some new clothes for work and stuff like that and then i'll start to go to the hair store because i need to install that wig right there from Elise hair and do a video on that so i have a little bit of things to do today so I'm just going to take y'all with me as I run those errands. But right now we're going to go walk the trails, have some private time, and then I'll pick the camera back up once I get back. Hey guys, so I just pulled up at Old Navy. So I'm going to go in and check for some leggings. I want to find some leggings out of there that I could wear to work. And probably maybe like some sweaters or like sweater dresses. So I'll let y'all know what I find once I get in there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, where the fuck should I really even start? I got hoes that I'm keeping in the dark. I got my niggas cross the street living large. Thinking back to the fact that they dead. Raps from the facts that they sat with the boss. I got two phones, one need a charge. Yeah, they twins, I can tell they ass apart. Hey guys, I am back home. I am back home and I just want to show y'all some of the stuff that I got at the stores today. Um, did a nice little shop, got some good work clothes and I got everything for under $200. So, budget hit that. Okay, so let me show y'all the stuff that I got. And yes, and I'll link everything below. First one I went into was called Frenzy. Um, I got these leggings. Um, I just had a pair of like good solid black leggings and I got these in a size small medium and they were $12.99. So just a good stretchy pair of leggings. And let me know if y'all want me to do like a try on home because I can do that. The second thing I got from Frenzy was another pair of leggings. These are brown. They were also $12.99, super stretchy, and it was it's in a size small medium. Then I went into Gap, and I got these leggings. So these leggings were on sale, but something about these Gap leggings, I didn't get to try them on yet because the lines are so long. But the thing about them is they're so heavy and thick. These leggings were originally $30. I got them on sale for $13. And then these I also got on sale for 13 bucks. There's a uh, blue pair of leggings. But they, when I tell you these leggings are thick, like that material is bomb. Then I went into Airy, love Airy if you know me. And this sweater was originally $60 and I got it for $23. So total bargain, but so cute, super cozy, super long. You can't really see it, but it's just super cozy. I love cozy things and I think this is really cute for work last thing is i went to forever 21 and i got this um sweater this sweater was 25 bucks and it's just like a little crop sweater got it in a size medium and then that airy sweater i got in a size small because their stuff runs really big on me but this i got in a size medium because i like this to look like a little bit more oversized just kidding back because i'm pregnant <laughs> I got this sweater. This sweater I got in a size small because I wanted it to fit like a top, not a sweater. And I have like a cute outfit idea for it. So that's why I got this one in a small. And I, I'm doing something this week. So I think I might wear it to that. And then the last sweater from Trevor 21 I got was this sweater. This sweater is another really thick sweater. And this sweater cost $27. And all in all, Trevor 21, I spent $80. So, for all my orders together, I'm going to total everything up so y'all can see how much everything costs. 
but I just like to make sure that I love to, you know, purchase things and be cute. But you also want to, you know, stay on a budget as well. And I went out today with a budget, so I'm going to total everything up. So from February 21, it was $84. From Airy, it was $24. From Uptown Frenzy, it was $28. And then from Gap, it was $29. I stayed under budget because my budget today was $200. And I spent... 165 and I got all these clothes y'all like I got all of these clothes for 165 this is such mix and match outfits like you have to really get basics because basics you can mix and match and make all kind of outfits with it and this is some good fall stuff so let me know if y'all want to try it all and I can show y'all what I bought but um yeah stay tuned Ryan and I are probably gonna like I'm gonna clean up myself a little bit get my edges together Put on some clothes and then we're probably going to go ahead to get some food because I'm so hungry. So I will chat with y'all when we get to the restaurant probably. Bye guys. Y'all I need to cut my hair my hair looking better. Like why am I coming on here and my hair looking like this? This is a mess. Like not cute. Mm. Anyways I'm about to get cute. So it's all good <laughs> but anyways hey guys it's been a minute since i've done like a vlog or whatever because sis has been busy okay sis has been busy but today we're having a little girls night you know i love me a girls night um let's talk about that because i think you know as women we need to be comfortable with like having girls nights like I'm talking I'm talking to the married women, I'm talking to the women who are dating. Like it is so important to have girls nights with your friends. Like that is so important to continue to cultivate and date your friends and cultivate those relationships because you need that. Like you need to have your girlfriends and people to lean on in community. You know, you can't like being married, you have to have community. Like you can't just go through it. You can't go you can't go it alone and think like, oh yeah, like uh, I got this. Like you need wisdom, you need insight, you need community. Anyways, I'm rambling. Um, I just got back in from the gym. Um, I'm still working out. I'm still doing that um, very consistently. It's just I haven't really been vlogging and stuff like that. So you haven't really seen that. I just went from the gym and picked up a few things in Ulta that I kind of needed for tonight. I did need a beauty blender because I think my husband threw my beauty blender away. Like I really think he did. He gonna tell me he didn't but i really think he did so i got me some more morphe setting spray because i just needed a new one i have another beauty blender like a fresh um beauty blender i only like the real beauty blender like i don't like that um i don't like that like fake stuff <laughs> so and then i got um so i got this morphe setting spray y'all know i love to use the morphe setting spray and then I also got this Bene Benefit Precisely My Brow. I love this too. I don't know if I use this too. I don't think I do my brows with y'all on a regular. But what I really like about this brow pencil, so I got this in a lighter shade this time. I usually get like four. But when I got my eyebrows done for my wedding, they had done this like light shade. And I think it's this one. I think it's this one, but I'm not sure. But this is looking a little dark. If I don't like it, I am definitely going to take it back. Because I don't play that. Like, if I don't like something, I don't like it. But this is in a shade 3.5. And I think I currently have four. But I should have got two. I was just afraid to. And then I was also debating getting this one. Because I like brown brows. I don't like black brows. So, we'll see how that works. If I don't like it, I'm taking it back. Don't care. Um, at all. And then, I went to Sephora the other day and just got a little pickups from the beauty. I, I did get some other stuff, but it's coming in the mail. But I got um, this Sephora Micro Smooth Powder. And I got it in the color Mahogany. So I'm going to try this out tonight. Hopefully I like it. I've never used anything like this before. So we'll see. But yeah, I'm about to get ready. About to get into makeup. About to get into 
glam and hair and get this head together because child what is going on the reason why my hair looks like this not that y'all ask but the reason why my hair looks like this is because um i got my y'all seen my last video was that i got my hair straightened but now i done wet the thing up and like it's not curly but it's also like not straight so i don't even know but what i'm thinking is yikes but what i'm thinking is i could do like two pieces in the front and curl them and then do like a um bun at the top you know catch my drift i don't know it's a mess but let me go get into hair and makeup because dinner is at 8 30 it's currently 6 so i need to leave the house by like 7 45 right now it's predicting 50 minutes to get there and i don't think it's gonna take that long but let's just get a move on in case traffic does not slow down and we do not want to be way late because i only hold the table for 10 minutes it's a new restaurant i'm gonna take y'all with me so y'all can see but it's super cute i'm excited to get pictures and content so see you guys in a little bit <laughs> hey friends so i'm all ready it is 7 32 and i remember dinner is at 8 30 so i have about an hour before i need to be there so i'm about to just i'm in my robe <laughs> So I'm about to just pop on my clothes and then um, I did my hair in like a little slick back bun. This is like what I do all the time <laughs> to my hair. So it's really my like little staple signature. So I did my hair in a little slick back bun and I am getting ready to just pop my clothes on. I need to wash my hand because I have some makeup on it. And I'm just getting ready to pop my clothes on and then I'll be out the door heading to Harper's. So I will check back in with y'all once I have my clothes on, show you my outfit, and we're about to go. Okay, y'all, so I am dressed and ready to go. Um, let me just show y'all the look. Just stand back. Here's the look. Hope y'all can see. Um, so my dress is from like a little boutique here. It's like a navy blue color, if y'all can see. Ooh, muscles, okay. <laughs> um, and then, uh, my earrings are from Zara um, bag, and my shoes, the uh, bag is Gucci, and then my shoes, Fashion Nova, legs brought to you by the gym. But yeah, I have everything that I need. My GPS is saying I'm gonna get there at 8.16, reservations are at 8.30, so that should give me enough time to like find it, valet, traffic if there is and go from there. I'm gonna bring some like slippers because I don't wanna um, drive in my heels, but I'm gonna bring like some slippers or something so that I can walk, um, so I can drive comfortably since it's a bit of a drive. But yeah, I'll see y'all when I get there. I hope I'm brave enough to bring the camera in. <laughs> okay, bye guys, because my bag is so small, so it's not like it can fit in there, so I'm gonna have to like hold it and that's gonna be awkward but whatever gotta do what you gotta do like this is the lifestyle <laughs> good morning you guys <coughs> excuse me <laughs> it's the next day and basically i did not take y'all with me to the restaurant yesterday let me be Look, let me be transparent with you guys. So, as a new vlogger, it's not always easy to, like, go into a restaurant and then just, like, whip out the camera. Especially, like, these, like, new restaurants that are, like, you know, popular and popping with, like, a lot of people. <laughs> it's not so easy to just go in there and whip out the camera. Like, I'm not there yet with... I guess my vlogging confidence and comfortability I just don't think I'm there but we had such a good time I'm gonna insert some clips because I, I mean some videos because I do have like video on my phone I just don't have videos like you know videos I don't have like footage like I don't have vlog footage but I do have footage <laughs> nonetheless Anyways, I am getting ready to go to the gym this morning. 
so we are having at my, so i go to a boot camp and um we're having a, a black light workout so everything is going to be dark and we're going to work out in the dark um and we're like supposed to wear like neon so this is really all i've got i don't even think this is neon i don't think this is gonna glow in the dark but i don't have nothing else so like is what it is this what i'm wearing um i'm basically gonna take y'all with me throughout the day um brian and i will probably go get some breakfast after that and then we're gonna do a little bit of furniture shopping and then maybe we'll go eat some dinner or something chill i don't know but i'll take you guys along um welcome to the weekend and yeah let's get it it's the week before thanksgiving break so yes love that definitely need like a little break and reprieve in our lives so really excited so let's go to the gym let's get it um okay abs are still abbing so love that for us okay i'll talk to you later bye guys with me Hell Mary. Guys, anyways, <laughs> I went to the gym, came back, got dressed, did my hair, put on some clothes, and Ryan and I are about to go grab smoothies and get the day going. Let me show y'all my OOTD in case you are interested. So it's just an all, it's monochromatic, of course, because who would I be if I didn't do a monochromatic look? Blue leggings from Aerie, blue hoodie from Aerie, same Gucci bag I had on last night. Watch uh, Gucci earrings, and yeah, hair is just in like a little slick back bun, nothing crazy. So, Ryan and I are about to go grab smoothies and get the day started. And I guess we'll check in with y'all when we make it to our next destination. Let's unbox this. I got a package from Sephora. Don't tell Ryan that I'm using. He might open it because he will be mad because he hates when I do that. But I know I shouldn't do it, but we're about to get like new. Nice anyways. But I got this is from the Sephora VIB sale. I got one thing and it came in this huge box. Make sure nothing else is in there. So I got the Fenty Beauty Eavesdrop. This is basically the like a tinted moisturizer, I think. It's not a foundation. Well, the girls are going crazy over this. It's a skin tint. So I've been trying to get this since summer, okay? And I got it in the color 17. It's finally in stock. Let's see if this is my color. I hope it is. I hope so, so much. But you know the fancy stuff kind of oxidizes. So if it looks dark, then whatever. If it, if it looks dark, that it's because it will look dark. But this is how it comes, super sleek. And then here's the package, but you can just like drop it on apparently. I'm probably gonna wear it this weekend. It smells like all the other stuff. Sometimes your stuff does break my skin out. I don't know if that's what I called it, but that's what it is. You can kind of see it. It's looking pretty good. So I'm probably gonna, and this is it on the back of my hand. So I'm probably gonna wear that this weekend. Thank you guys for tuning into the vlog. If you made it all the way to the end, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm thinking about doing Vlogmas. So if you guys don't know what Vlogmas is, it's basically like, basically what Vlogmas is, it's uploading 25 days until Christmas. I cannot upload 25 days until Christmas because I have a job. Um, and I have to go to my job and I can't like edit videos all day and stuff like that. But I can do like weekly vlogs. So I was thinking about weekly vlogmas you'll get to see ryan and i do activities like decorate the house for christmas put up the christmas tree um you know things like that put go do look at christmas lights and go christmas shopping just like christmas tradition -y, things like that so let me know if that's content you guys are interested in if it is then i will definitely lay that out don't forget to like comment subscribe if you made it all the way through don't forget to give me a fire emoji 
this weekend one of my best friends is coming to town and i'm gonna be vlogging it and we're gonna have so much fun i can't wait <laughs> Um, I really can't wait for her to come. So don't forget to tune into that because I'll be posting that content next week. But yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.